Good morning, Freedom House family. I hope everybody's doing well. Uh, missed you guys the last couple of uh, devotions that I did, but uh, I was working on our uh, Easter program with my wife, Amy. Hope everybody enjoyed that. If not, check it out. It's on our Facebook page, on YouTube, and also on our website. Uh, today, well, it's a beautiful day in Oregon. Today was up early this morning, letting the chickens out and just kind of Soaking in what God has created uh, and all this mess, it's just uh, you look beyond that and you see what beauty uh, God has created for us. And my uh, devotion today is in 2 Corinthians 4, 16 through 18. And let me just read that to you here right quick. Therefore, we do not lose heart, though outwardly we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are becoming renewed day by day. For our light and momentary troubles are achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen, since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. Wow, pretty uh, appropriate verse for what's going on around us today. Uh, a couple things here. Let's let's put this all in perspective. Uh, what is unseen? Like this virus is unseen and whatnot. We don't really know what's going on that. But if you think about what Paul is explaining to us here in 2 Corinthians, uh, is where's our focus? Are we focusing on what's happening around us or are we focusing on what is eternal? What is God? What is Jesus? Uh, and the renewing of our minds. Uh, I would suggest uh, every, everybody that uh, during this time of trouble, devote some time to the Bible and do some reading. Renew your mind, as uh, uh, Paul is saying here in 2 Corinthians, that uh, rather than... Uh, fixing our eyes on what's happening today and what is around us. Focus on what is unseen. Focus on the Holy Spirit, what God is prompting us to do and uh, how to behave and just how to react and all this uh, to help relinquish our fears, our anxieties, whatever may be coming up. Uh, let me pray for everybody here. Uh, Heavenly Father, I just give thanks for this wonderful day that you've created. Um, I uh, uh, ask blessings over my my uh, Freedom House family, my family, uh, both seen and unseen, both near and both afar, Lord. Uh, just to give everybody a, a double dose of your blessing today and uh, just encourage them to and help them to renew their mind and focus on not what is seen around us, but what is unseen, which is you. Thank you. In Jesus' precious name I pray. Amen. So with that, I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Uh, again, uh, at the bottom down below the video here, I'll put links to our website uh, and our Facebook and YouTube channels. Uh, again, drop us a line once in a while, see what's going on, uh, how you're doing, if there's anything we can do for you, any prayer requests or whatever we can do within our means, we would surely be more than happy to help you out. You guys have a blessed day. God bless you all. See ya.